Welcome to this video. Are you interested in why your vehicle diagnosis displays P1794? How is the error code interpreted by the vehicle? What does P1794 mean, or how to correct this fault? Today we will find answers to these questions together. Let's do this. First, let's look at the history of diagnostic fault code composition according to the OBD2 protocol, which is unified for all automakers since 2000. We divide the electric system of automobile into the four basic units. Powertrain. Body. Chasis. Network. This distribution is defined in the first character code. If the second character is expressed as zero, it is a standardized error. In the case of numbers 1, 2, 3 it is a more prestigious expression of the car-specific error. The third character specifies a subset of errors. The distribution shown is valid only for the standardized DTC code. Only the last two characters define the specific fault of the group. Let's not forget that such a division is valid only if the other character code is expressed by the number 0. Our website airbagreset.sk produces useful videos for you. You do not have to go through the OBD2 protocol anymore to know how to troubleshoot any car breakdown. You will find all the diagnostic codes that can be diagnosed in a Lexus, vehicles, also many other useful things. The following demonstration will help you look into the world of software for car control units. You unbelievably can move the video a bit further. The error code is split into two bytes consisting of 16 bits. One bit is the basic unit that each computer works with. The bit has two logical states. 0, low level. 1, high level. By combining the first two bits, the basic character of the error code is expressed. The next two bits again determine the second character. The last bit styles of the first byte define the third character of the code. The second byte is composed of a combination of eight bits. The first four bits determine the fourth character of the code. And the combination of the last four bits defines the fifth character. A single byte conceals 256 possible combinations. We now know in what way the diagnostic tool translates the received information into a more comprehensible format. The number itself does not make sense to us if we cannot assign information about it to what it actually expresses. So, what does the diagnostic trouble code P1794 interpret specifically Lexus car manufacturers? The basic definition is Driver Active Headrest Control Circuit Short to Battery And now this is a short description of this DTC code. The Driver Active Headrest Signal Circuit is driven by a solenoid that also uses a diode in parallel The single electrical component of the AHR Active Headrest Unit is the latch release solenoid The solenoid is connected by a two-way pigtail wire and harness connector The pigtail wire and two-way connector are routed through the center of one of the headrest support posts and down through the guide sleeve to the interior of the seat back, where it connects to the seat wire harness The solenoid is grounded at an independent dedicated ground the AHR components itself cannot be repaired if damaged or ineffective the AHR active headrest must be replaced as a new assembly if upon inspection the AHR has deployed it can be reset following the proper reset method refer to restraints restraint active head standard procedure also if the already deployed driver or passenger AHR are latched in the locked position please see the scan tool miscellaneous functions to set the latch in the unlock or deployed position please be very observant and careful the scan tool should never be used to actually deploy a known good non-deployed driver or passenger AHR this diagnostic error occurs most often in these cases R676 Active Head Restraint First Row Driver Signal Circuit OPEN R676 Active Head Restraint First Row Driver Signal Circuit Shorted to VOLTAGEZ 913 Active Head Restraint First Row Driver Ground Circuit OPEN DRIVER Head RESTRAINT OCC UPANT Restraint Controller ORC 
The Airbag Reset website aims to provide information in 52 languages. Thank you for your attention and stay tuned for the next video.